how's it going guys? My name is Weefies. This weather is no use. For the day before Christmas, it is the 24th of December, which is any reason to celebrate. Even if you don't celebrate Christmas, it is the 24th of December, which means 20 secret hidden chests or places Christmas edition. That's right. I have decorated this house with 20 different hidden entrances that I think they're pretty cool and they're very diff very diverse. So, there's 20 different entrances and if you guys do want to check them out, I will leave a tutorial if you do want that. However, I'm going to be showcasing all 20 designs in today's video and hopefully maybe you can find them before I even show them. Like just looking around here, do you guys see anything that catches your eye? Anything at all? Anything at all? Anyway, I will scatter these 20 coins in 20 different chests throughout the whole build. I will see you guys in the video. Consider subscribing because this did take the better part of 3 hours. And yes, thanks so much for watching. Let's get right into it. So the first one is really quite simple. All we gotta do is go up to this painting, but as you might know, well, we can't walk through it. Nah, nah, nah. It's not that simple, boys. All we gotta do is throw an item right over here on this pressure plate, and then we can walk through pick up the item, grab our first coin of the day, there are going to be 20 coins, and then boom, throw the item, walk back out, pick it up, and then we're out of that one. Number two is the old fireplace. Santa's coming down, we have a nice fireplace burning, but oh, what's that? If we just peek behind the fire, we can't even see it, but let me tell you for sure, there is a chest behind here, and if you guys want to see how I did that, it's just a little chest right here. There's nothing special. It's just obstructed by the fire, so that makes it very, very hard to see, so pretty good one there. Moving on to number three. Right next to it is number three. In case of emergency, break the iron bar. Well, this is an emergency. We want our coins. Let me just break this right here. And now if I go into this fireplace, it is going to hurt a little. I'm going to have to shift to get in. Oh, I'm like Santa Claus. If I look up through all the steam and mist, there is actually a chest up here with the coins. This is also really easy. What I need is a campfire and an iron bar and a chest, of course. Let me put all this stuff in here. Moving on to number four. Alright, so right over here is number four, and this looks like an ordinary chest, right? I mean, it's covered, but so you'd think there'd be something wrong with it, but no. The key feature is actually below the chest, we have a minecart that I can hop into and collect this. And the way to get out of this minecart is really quite simple. All you gotta do is head down here and then ender pearl somewhere out of the corner. Uh, I need to just figure it out. Let me let me just break that. Oh, oops, oops, oops. Uh, no, 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 no. And I just place that block right here, and you can see I am out. Ah, uh, what a flawless entrance. Let me just put that in there. Number five, I have my trusty bow and arrow with me. I'm just gonna go, and you can see this lovely little centerpiece. But oh, what's that? Well, if I actually hit this button and I run up, uh, well, I don't need this bow to do it. So let me uh, actually hit the button. All right, maybe it's not gonna work. Let me just press the button for you guys. And you can see we can actually reach up here and grab our fifth coin as the ceiling retracts. Nothing very complicated here, just some basic redstone. Alright, so number six is quite a crafty one. This gorgeous Christmas tree I have built up. It's okay, it's okay, I know it's beautiful. So if I actually crawl down here with this very decorative trap door, I can actually creep down here and then throw my bow, and it will get picked up, and then just seconds later, this little hatch will open up in the floor, and I can grab my sixth coin. This design is really easy to make, and if you guys want a tutorial, just let me know, and I will be able to do it. But that brings us right to number seven. Well, I have this lovely snow carpet, but is that all it is? Absolutely not, folks. If we just crawl down here, there, of course, is another coin. Pretty easy scaffolding trick. Let's hop out into the backyard for now for number eight, nine, and ten. Let's start with number eight. I just closed the door in my face. Grab this hoe and just hoe next to this tree. And then right there, what's that cheeky little fella doing? Boom. Eight coins. Moving on to number nine. Go into this gorgeous shed. If I just crawl under here, oh, these are just decoy chests. Actually, behind the door. No one thinks to look there. That is the ninth coin of 20. We're doing pretty good, folks. Right over here is number 10. It's just a lovely little fountain we got. Nothing suspicious going on, but let's take a look at it. Can you spot what's wrong? I'm sure you can. Boom. This was one of our less hidden ones, but n nobody's going to look under there. Let's be honest. Come on, what are you doing looking under there? Number 11 is quite nice because it wants you to feed people. So let me just get my food that I have cooked up and I just put it in here. Uh, I, I just put it in here and then boom, this opens up as well. What a nice, and I can just grab the food and, and we're all good. That's a really nice furnace entrance. It's very simple to make. Moving on to number 12, we have this really gorgeous washing machine. And this is a really hard one to spot because you can't spot anything wrong with this. Even now, 
Like, what can you spot wrong with this? There's nothing wrong with this. But maybe you guys can see it. There's actually one snow layer missing from the top, which you cannot spot at all when it's like this. So if I actually go underneath here and I just uh, close it on myself, you can see you have to go. It's very hard to access this chest. You have to jump and right click at the same time. But there, boom, I have some plates and some cups in there. But along with that, I have the coin. Number 13, we're about to have a lovely Thanksgiving dinner, and what is this very inconspicuous shelf that we're just rails on? Well, let's just grab our minecart and rails, and then nobody will suspect. If we just go forward in this little minecart here, and keep going into the stair, and then hold down, we actually get into a secret room. And then we can just chill here with a chest and some and free ender pearls. Of course, we don't need those ender pearls, because we're too cool. All you gotta do is right click this minecart, and we're back out. Nobody saw nothing. Let's just let. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no. Let's let's just clean this up right here so that nobody suspects a thing. Honestly, I think this video isn't really festive enough, so I'm just gonna put in some Christmas lights. Let's put some alternating, you know, torches. So torch, torch, torch. Oh, what's the what? Oh, what? Oh, well, look at that. Look at that. Decorating does pay off sometimes. It definitely does pay off. Let's just put that back over there. Number 15 is kind of a music one. You're chilling with your friends, and then, oh, what's that? You want to play some jams? I got you. We can open that up, and then a new coin right in the floorboards. No one suspects the jams. As suspicious as this corner may look, there's actually nothing going on here, fun fact. Moving on to the next one, number 16. You're watching some TV with the family. Well, what's this TV doing? Whoa, no, no, no. You can't just hide a coin from us like that. That's too easy. For this next one, we're going to have to go all the way to the top of the house, which is going to be quite a pain because it's nighttime. But let me just climb up here, so give me a sec. I, I'm not really good at climbing ladders. Pretty slow. We have this chimney right here, which is actually a very, really conspicuous place because who's going to jump into that? Well, I am because there's water at the bottom. And then, boom, a free gorgeous chest with another coin. This chest has been here for a while, so it is a bit webby. Let me just climb that up here. Uh, let me just interact with this minecart. This is a very hard minecart to press, by the way. Gonna have to really right click that one. You know what? We're just gonna. Oh, wait, it's in the. It's in. It's in the block. Come on, man. The last three I got for you guys are really, really cool. Moving on to this one, you wouldn't expect anything at all. Anything at all, right? Well, guess again. Blocks don't. Redstone. Red, blo redstone blocks don't usually power like this, but this speaker design actually got something going for it hidden chest boom this is using something called quasi connectivity I did a video I did, I did, I did a video about that if you want to check it out I think it's a pretty cool concept but you'll never find this or maybe you could just hit this button I mean th this button works too but but that's not as cool number 19 is going to be the stockings these have been on the little mantle for as long as I can remember but if we just tilt this middle one to exactly the downwards position you'll see that a hole actually opens up in the floor and we can get another coin and then tilt it one to the side and boom the hole closes so we can just keep that there and now number 20 have you guys been able to detect it have we gone through everything do you think we've exhausted everything well look again I'll, I'll give you a long look what do you think it is if you guys think you know what the last little hidden easter egg is then comment down below because we have hidden a chest extraordinarily well for you guys very very well and by we I mean me Alan without further ado drum roll please number 20 you actually have to fly and hack just kidding just kidding just kidding you don't have to fly and hack at all actually it's right here with the floor this may look like a normal wood floor but if I right click on this block right here it's actually the bottom of a lectern you guys may not know this but lectern bottoms look okay that sounded weird you guys may not know this, but lectern behind, lectern bottom side, the bottom of lecterns look exactly like wooden planks when tilted the correct way. So I can actually hide a lectern and subscribe to Weefies, and then boom, reveals a coin. We can close that up, and no one is any wiser. But that, guys, concludes all 20 lovely Christmas decorations I have hidden throughout this video. If you have enjoyed and made it to the end, then thank you so much for watching. I hope your Christmas is great. I will see you all tomorrow on Christmas with a lovely Christmas-themed grumbo moments. I mean, green moments. I'll see you all tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching. Consider subscribing, and peace out. Adios.